previously on Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. If you're a Souls veteran like myself, you cannot treat it like a Souls game. Yes. What good are you? You were nowhere to be. Tell me you didn't lead them here yourself. The timing of their attack was perfect. Normally those bandits. Yes, I hope you. And what's going on, guys? Crusader here. Welcome back to Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. So you joined me pretty close to immediately after the previous episode. I am going to be, instead of going back to the estate. Hmm, I should... Nah, we're going to go back to the estate. We're going to go back to the memory. And farm up. Now, I say farm, but I use that kind of loosely with this game. You're able to get so many experience points and enemies lined up for your person that you don't even have to worry about farming too much unless you want to. But before we move on, I'm going to put on my Shinobi prosthetic tools. Get the loaded axe ready to go because I'm going to need it for some shield wielders here. And I'm hoping to hit one major mini boss that I always have problems with until recently. So I'm going to work my way towards the new section that oops, that was opened up from the previous time that I was here. We are still going to take these two down because if I don't, they become a big nuisance later on. Got the axe wielder. Come on, buddy. So I'm gonna work this guy down first, then I'm going. Cause he's gonna get ahead of them, which is fine by me. Play a little bit aggressively with him. So the way that the loaded axe works. Or with any shinobi process that you have to use your left, no, not left, right trigger for it to work correctly. Good, I do have shards on. Gonna pull him way out of the way. Pretty sure he can't pull anybody that's too close by. Or in the clear. So he's dead, that's a plus. I have to keep an eye on the Shinobi Hunter himself, because I don't have the presence yet. Oh, there he is. That's right, you can come after me, I don't care. As long as I can keep the shinobi hunter away from me, I'm fine. Oh, they lost track of me, that works too. Splitting him up always helps. 
I gotta be careful with him because of the axe. I always have problems with axes. Ouch! And that's why. Damn! I had to heal myself already. You can die, thank you. Do not come again. Not what I wanted to do. Whoa. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. Get away, get away, get away. Oh, that was close, that was close, that was close. You can die, thank you, go away. Keep those spare beads. Oh. Man, that was super close. I need to hit up, <laughs> I need to go back and get all my stuff back. Nope, just the last place I rested at. And as you can see, getting the Makira kind of early does really help, especially in that fight, because he was thrusting his spear about a good 50% of the time, it looked like. Hop up here, clunk. Now, start moving my way towards... Stab, done, thank you. Now I gotta retrace my steps. More or less do the same thing that I just finished doing. can do I can just run past these guys hop down here and you 
just hop myself up here. There's more, there we go. Nice and easy, more or less. Now there is, I believe it's a heavy coin purse here. But there are several of these guys around. Don't don't do it. I got several there. So we're gonna hop over here because there's one right here. And all this stealthing really personally reminds me of all oh, an archer. It reminds me of the Tenchu games back in the day for PS1 and 2. I don't know if they ever came out with one for PS3. on you, dude. Come on. Oh, gee. Come on. No, stop. Thank you. Come again. Well, don't come again. I know what this is leading me. Okay. So this is just talking about consecutive wall jumps. I just butt mash. Because I never got the timing down correctly. So here's the next major section. More oil. And our next blue statue. Now this next fight's not exactly the easiest, but there is a way of doing it. And I'm going to see if I can manage to not cheese it necessarily, but I'm going to try to get some assistance from an NPC that's close by. I'm going to yank myself up here, and we're going to run along the rooftops to avoid a ton of enemies that are in here. Well, one saw me, but that's not that big of a deal. I believe it was just an archer. You don't see anything, stop yelling. Hi, loser. That was a cheap trick. Go down as well. Light coin purse. This is actually the hard part. I'll just leave them all away. Oh, jeez. Well, that's the mini boss. Crap, wrong one. What I'm gonna attempt to do here is. No! Damn it! Ah, oh, jeez. 
Sorry, fat boy. Not today. I mean to hit triangles so I can get my firecrackers on. Ah! I'm probably gonna have to do this again because he's just he hits really hard. All I want to do is just break him up, take most of them down. Yeah, I got nothing. So they're all still looking, which is fine. <sighs> and I really don't want this whole episode just being just this fight, because it is a pain in the ass at this point in time. Just confuse him. Do I have any kind of. Oh, good. I got some pellets left. That'll actually help me a lot. Damn it. Do not want to fight. No, pause. Come on, losers. I'll have all day. Music starts dying off, that's a good sign. Okay, so he went back to his regular spot. Catch me, fat boy. I don't know what the heck you're freaking playing at. So all I'm trying to do is just get to this last guy that's right here in the corner. Ooh, can I? Ooh, I wonder. I want to see if I can get a... Ooh, plus he dropped the pellet. Perfect. Let's go ahead and heal myself. And let's pop a... Let's pop one of my favorite sugars. Oh 
Oh, God. Damn it. I'm not done yet. Oh, screw you, dude. I fired a cracker and you went right through it? I don't think so. He is not easy at this point, especially with not having any enhancements. It's a pain, but I'm going to clear him within this episode. Yep, loss upon death. So, here's the first portion. Now, do I have any skills that I can use? I wonder. Acquire skills. Not that I'm seeing at the moment. Well, that obviously, but. The mid air deflection is actually not bad to have. Oh, 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 oh. gonna purchase some more just to be on the safe side because we're pretty at least I'm very reliant on it get my loaded axe equipped well obviously they're like in a burning man well they're in a burning fort you did not see anything. Don't give me that crap. Anyway, they're in a burning fortress, so I'm not surprised that they're dropping. Dousing powder. Hell up. Uh oh. Oh, that's right, I got whirlwind slash. Gonna use one of our ninja sugars. Start the running. So I managed to take out a couple of them this time around. That boy sounds like he's seriously on my heels. Gotta find him. Oh, there he is, there he is. So this time around, I'm actually gonna pop my tack sugar. Side frames, thank you, run away. Oh boy. All that cash.
Well, good grief, how far do I have to frickin' go before he finally disappeared and lets it go? That's the real question. There we go. Gonna pop my very final ninja sugar. Oh good, I can hit him. No problem. No problem. You can die. That mother monkey. Get my prayer beads. And the sake we're going to share with the sculptor. like a ninja, run like a ninja. Okay, so with Fat Boy finally taken care of, there is some... Oh. There's some items in here that are pretty crucial, plus a set Ow! Oh, son no, you freaking don't. No, I'm still alive. And so is your buddy is not. Okay. No, get away from that. Get up, there we go. So here's the major secret. There is a ninja door right here. I'll let you here. Flash you to get a wealth balloon. Another light coin purse. But what I really want divine confetti and uh, the chest. Now the chest typically you yeah, they typically have pick up the prayer bead, thank you. They have prayer beads, ninety five percent of the time I believe. Haven't come across one that didn't have one. But there is a first time for everything when it comes to stuff like that. There's the old woman that gave us the bell to get here to begin with. Now, I can rest. And we are going to enhance physical ability. First prayer bead necklace. So loose prayer beads struggle 
strung together in offering to the sculptor's idol increases maximum vitality and posture. Prairie necklace benefits the strong. For sight of you, as army is rewarding throughout the nation. So my thing went up just a little bit, not by much, but a little. Now with that done, I can't go to the boss that's right there yet. Only because I just don't have... Now if you want to farm, you can farm all these guys all over again if you need to. I don't know if it's worth it, but if you are... Oh, it's just a scope saddle. If you want to farm for stuff, as far as uh, skill points and stuff like that, you can farm. So I'm going to travel back to the stairwell outside the wall, and now we're going to go take down the Chained Ogre. Which will give me an additional string of prayer beads. There is two more mini bosses before I hit the main boss. There's this one that I'm about ready to come on to. It's just another general, just like the first one that I came across. And then there is uh, the giant snake. That one, he's not so bad. He doesn't give you prayer beads, unfortunately. So I'm going to run over here. We're going to grab some pellets. But first and foremost, I'm going to... I not oh no I don't back off now so this guy he's a oh hey 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 he's a huge pain in the butt You are not throwing me over the edge. I've done that enough. Stun. Nope. Damn it. Throw me. Thank you. I can heal myself. Now those two guards that I just killed. No. Oh. His weakness is fire, so you can set him on fire. He'll stun for a couple of minutes. There is the very... Ouch. Okay, I got cocky there. No. Close. 
damn it! I'm dead. That's seriously frustrating when that happens. So, with the two guards in front of him that I killed before even going up to the chain dogger, they tell you that he is weak to fire. You can hit him up with an oil urn if you want, and then blast him twice with the uh, flame barrel. Get rid of that. That's oh, unforeseen aid. Very nice. Yes, I know about unforeseen aid. Thank you. So you can do that, which I should do that. Oh damn it! Not what I wanted to do. Just wanted to charge up and just attack him. That's what I'm gonna do. Come on, big boy. off now you can do okay that was bullshit anyway you can do some Dark Souls-esque stuff as far as dodging is concerned Um, you can strafe around them and get hits in that way. And back away from him, getting some distance. Or you can get hit just like I did. Oh, screw you, dude. Do I have... Okay, good. How many... Oh, I got eight storage. No. Stab. That's your first health bar. Son of a bitch. Get up there. I'm gonna use that, and then I'm gonna use one of my Ungo sugars. Now, I know it's not much for the pellets, but it's I don't have anything left. So the attack you keep seeing me do is just a grapple attack. That's the one that I picked up earlier. Ugh! Necessary for this fight. And for the first major boss fight. No! Well, I'm dead. Oh, well, not fully.
I got nothing left, do I? Yeah, I got nothing. Damn it! Damn it, damn it. I keep getting so dang close. Oh, man. So I apologize for this kind of boring content, going through and just getting my butt kicked over and over, but that just goes to show how difficult this game is. And how much you cannot treat it like a Souls game, like I had mentioned in the last episode. It just doesn't work that way. I'm trying to remember if there is an additional gourd seed that I'm missing somewhere. Nope, you die. Immediately you die here. When it does that, that's when the... I've died to it several times when it just suplexing me and throw me over a cliff. So annoying when it does that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, and this one, Dragon Rot, pops up. Yes, I know about Dragon Rot. Can't do anything until I talk to Emma. Have you seen yeah. all I have? However, it is he for this. I do not think. Goodbye. Okay, now let's go back to the. St and it's beyond dumb the fact that I have to be yanked all the way back there just to say, oh yeah, there's this new mechanic called Dragon Rod where if you don't. Watch yourself. Your unseen aid goes down severely, mind you. And it, uh. It impedes them. It doesn't kill them necessarily, I think, so far. I'm not sure yet. But Dragon Rat comes from being part of the Divine Errors bloodline. There's not much information that I know about it yet. I needed. There. No. Oh, you are a prick and a half. You know that. There's the first one. Very nice. 
stop kicking me. Okay, this is ridiculous. No, damn it, I'm dead. Go figure. Not fully dead yet, but almost. Got one more. And you're just gonna kick me each time I do that. Fine. No! I almost had it killed. I keep getting greedy, that is my problem. Just keep getting greedy, and that's never smart. what you get for doing that. Ah! Oh. oh, they both replaced my pellets. Okay, now get away. Of those that'd be awesome. Quarter of herself, that's good for me. No. That's fine too. Gives me a chance to breathe. Oh good, got him. That clip me. No! Dick! Whew, too close. Too close, too close, too close. Now we're gonna say my other sugar just. Okay. Get out of the way. Come on. I'm just dancing around him. Come on, just focus. Thank you, that's what I want you to do. There we go. You stab. And you're dead. Uh, 
one set of prayer beads, plus we get Shinobi Medicine rank 1. So that it allows me to have better recovery with all the gourd heals that I've been doing as of lately. Gonna rest. There we are. Alright guys, that is going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like for me. Drop a comment down below. Tell me how you, what you guys are thinking about the series thus far. I know we haven't done very much, but I'm working on it. We're still trying to get good. And that's the whole idea of this whole entire run. Don't forget to drop by the Twitch channel that I stream three times a week. Usually on Monday, Thursday, Fridays. Don't forget to also drop by the Twitter where you guys can interact with me and I interact right on back. Leave a follow there to be notified when I'm going to be going live. And I also have a brand new community up on PlayStation Network called the Black Templar Games Nights. You guys will be notified when I'm going to be going doing streams there as well. And as always guys, don't forget to leave a sub over on the YouTube channel for brand new content uploaded pretty close to daily. I'm trying to get back on on that schedule. But until next time, guys, I hope you have a good one. Take it easy.